Hey guys, just wanted to do a quick uh, couple videos on a couple of my top fives. Uh, I'm going to start this one off with my top five electrical tools or diagnose tools and then I'll probably do top five specialty tools, top five maybe kit tools, top five hand tools, top five cordless tools, but uh, let's kick this one off. I got uh, my laptops I use to diagnose these cars. This first one is a smaller one. The next book, it's running Windows 10, I believe. It's pretty nice. Hook it up to the car, get mode six, to pull up all your PIDs. It's also detachable. So I could use it as a tablet too. Just looking stuff something up if I gotta go on Mitchell or all data. It's got a camera on it. This one's pretty nice. And then I got the tough book. My older laptop, still use it. This thing's tough as nails. It's got a touch screen on it too. But uh, this one's been with me through thick and thin. You can drop this one and it doesn't break. It's waterproof, water resistant. Still pretty good. Gotta love those tough books. Next one, obviously, the Vera scanner. I got this one uh, updated all the way to 18.2. It's got the Harley Davidson on there. What is the update to this one? Yeah, 18.2. Great scanner. Love using the scope. Battery holds a really good charge. Pretty much running windows on this one too. If you guys haven't seen these, check them out. They're nice. So exit, pretty much just windows. Got my shop stream on there. Identifix, ProDemand, all the good ones. Next is the Bosch pass-through. This is a little bit older one, but it still works great. I have no problem flashing cars with it. Runs pretty quick, and it, it, I use it with either the Tough Book on my Forens, or the next book on most of the domestics and things like that. Updating PCMs and all that. Great tool. I'm be upgrading this one soon, so I'll probably be giving this one away. Stay tuned for that. Next one. Most of these are snap-on tools. That's the Predator Vision. Great tool. Use this for more and more stuff every day. Check for misfires, bad heated seat elements. I mean, hanging up calibers, the list goes on and on. This is a great tool. Um, it picks up heat signature. You can see, camera's not really picking it up, but it picks up heat signature on devices or cars or love this tool pretty small compact it's got menu options to show you good and bad battery cables known good that's known bad you can obviously see getting hot known good nice and cool 
You could snap pictures with it. Great tool. Check it out if you guys haven't seen it. Next one I got. Snap on multi probe. Fantastic tool. Especially if you guys are used to using the power probe or a multimeter. This one is uh, great. It's like five tools in one. Um, I'm still getting to know how to use all the features, but uh, what a fantastic tool this one is. There's another handheld one. The screen faces towards you, so when you're back probing a wire, you can see the screen. It's a little big on some of those tighter areas, but this one is great. Power Probe made this for Snap-on and they, uh, they outdid themselves. Great tool for diagnosing. But that's my five. Got the multi-probe, thermal imager, predator vision I call it, my Bosch flash, Flasher Pro, the Varus, and my laptops. Gotta have my laptops in most of these cars. Can't do much of anything without uh, using a computer. All right guys, my next one's probably gonna be Top five specialty tools. That should be pretty interesting. And then we're gonna do maybe a top five kit tools or hand tools. We'll see where it goes. Don't forget about my Modus giveaway. Um, still sitting up here, waiting on a new owner. I'm gonna be doing a drawing end of this month. And uh, probably be giving away this one too. But stay tuned guys, we'll talk to you soon.